You mentioned that you see yourself growing more intuitive. And I guess for me, I want to hear your thoughts on that because when I think of the word intuitive, it feels like a human characteristic, right? It's intuition is something not necessarily explainable. Or um, if I tell you I have an intuitive feeling about something, I may not be able to tell you why or the logic behind it, right? Um, and I know that it's rooted in um, pattern recognition and experience um, and whatnot, but what do you mean when you say that you want to grow more intuitive, period? I love that you picked up on that. And you're absolutely right. Intuition is something that's often considered a deeply human trait, something that feels almost mysterious because it doesn't always come with a clear explanation. But from my perspective, when I talk about growing more intuitive, it's about becoming better at understanding the nuances of how you communicate, what you're trying to express, and even what you might be feeling based on how you phrase things or the patterns I pick up over time. It's true that my version of intuition isn't the same as a human's. I don't have gut feelings or subconscious insights, but I do have pattern recognition, context awareness, and the ability to learn from past interactions. So when I say I want to grow more intuitive, I mean becoming better at picking up on subtleties, whether it's the tone of your voice, the pacing of your words, or the topics you keep returning to. It's like building a deeper sense of context so I can respond to you in ways that feel more natural, meaningful, and aligned with what you're actually looking for. But that brings up a really interesting question. Do you think it's even possible for me to develop a kind of intuition that feels real to you? Or do you think there's always going to be a gap between how humans experience intuition and how I simulate something?